In the previous video, I showed that the project successfully copied the codes of a transmitter and then sent them as required by the user. It was also able to cause disruption. But nothing was set to write the codes desired by the user. In this video, I'm gonna address the same issue. Because I'm not allowed to teach, I can only say that this part was challenging and long, so that more than 80% of the microcontroller's memory was occupied. But finally the project was finished. See the result. Now we can say that all the operations can be performed at 433 frequency. Now we have to do all these things for 315 frequency as well. To perform this operation on the 315 frequency, it's enough to change the modules. This is done by relays. By selecting the frequency 315, the relays are activated. Well, this project is over, the program and the circuit diagram will be placed on GitHub. Just be careful that the memory occupied in the microcontroller doesn't exceed 80% because it may disable parts that we do not understand. And the end, um, thank you for watching. See you in the next videos. Bye for now.